Craig, 5 0 win at the time at Sutherland Stadium against Darlington. Hat trick for Sam Osborne, goals from Diego and Jack McCourt. Does it feel like you've turned a corner? Is that the biggest the biggest sort of point from this? Um, no, not really. I think obviously we've we've been sort of improving week on week. I know the reasons why we had a bit of a slow start. You know, injuries, people missing training, and, and I've said all along we'll, we'll keep improving. And you can see that today. I thought that first half were a level where I see us playing. Um, the quality, the pressing, the energy that we had. Um, Darlington couldn't live with us, and uh, we, we totally deserved to win the game from minute, the first minute to the last minute. So sort of starting Sam Osborne, three goals in the first half. Is that the sort of catalyst, not just about Sam, but about the team going out, getting the goals early doors? Yeah, well, like I said, we're at home. We've got a really impressive home record, and we want, we're proud of that. We want to keep it going. Um, we know today could be difficult for Darlington. They've got some good players, but. We never let him breathe, um, and like I said, we were clinical at the right times. And uh, I'm really pleased with Sammy. We're just so good today, so good. And uh, along with the other lads, you know, everybody played the part. Talking about sort of injuries and players coming back. Obviously, big squad to select from today. Um, was that difficult? You know, trying to pick the team and 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 the subs. To be honest, yeah, it's difficult. Of course, it is. It's um, it's probably the worst part of the job telling lads that um, they're on the bench or they're not even in the the squad. Um, it's not something I enjoy, but it's obviously something I have to do, and I, I do it for the benefit of the team, the club, um, to try and win games of football. So. The lads need to stick together, support each other, because everybody's going to be needed. It's, you can see this week, three massive games, and uh, we need to use everybody. And I'm just pleased that they're a good set of lads, they really are, and um, we've, we've had a really good sort of three matches on track now. Word for the goalkeeper in the defence, three clean sheets in a row, so it's not all about the goals recently, but is that pleasing to see that you're starting to, to shut out at the back as well? Yeah, the defence and, and Max in the Nets been brilliant all season to be honest with you um, and I think again the team defends as a team and, and sort of the, like you said today I um, thought we shut them out really well and to get three clean sheets on the trot in this league is, is pretty impressive and uh, deserve a lot of praise. Bit of versatility in the squad as well, uh, players played in sort of multiple positions as well as today um, like to Diego and Tommy who've played up top, played yeah. in midfield, um, Buzzer coming on gives a different, di different option. Is that useful in the sort of squad that you've got now that you can change things up as, as you go? It is, and that's why I try to put this squad together. Um, you, you know through suspensions, injuries, that players will have to play in different positions. Um, and I'm very fortunate, you know, we've got people like Diego and Tamale coming on who are both outstanding players. And then you've got Connor Brown and Max Hunt who have been brilliant as well, you know, on the bench. So, like I said, I can go on. Um, we're very much a unit and a team and Lazarus needs to keep sort of supporting each other, um, encouraging each other and hopefully the good form continues. Impressive performance by Jake right up top, handful all game, sort of unlucky not to get the goal that Sam got with his second. Um, have you been pleased to get him back fit as well and give a different dimension up top? Yeah, I mean, obviously I've signed Jake three, four times. In my opinion, he's one of the best strikers in this league. Um, when he's fit, when he's enjoying his football, he's an absolute handful and you can see that today. Although he's not scored, he's such a good foil for the rest of the team and... Uh, you know, I think a lot of Sam's goals and form at the minute are down to Jake, sort of freeing him up. And uh, yeah, um, obviously the lads are a good player. Players coming back from injury, um, obviously you've struggled with a, with a few recently, but is it impressive to see uh, Josh Granite come through a pre uh, you know, behind closed doors friendly last week, training? Um, how hard is it going to be now moving forward? Obviously, team winning and scoring goals, changing things up. Yeah, no, we're going to need everybody. Like I said, there's different ways we want to play away from home. You know, we've changed formation, which has um, been great for me. You know, we've got different options and uh, Josh Granite's our captain and um, we know how you know, important he is to us. Um, but it's like everybody else, they've got to fight now and, and train hard and, and wait for an opportunity. And when it comes, they've got to keep the shirt and um, it's really healthy. Um, and I know these lads will rise to that challenge, you know, they're going to push each other to the best they can be. Quick turnaround again, game's thick and fast still. Gloucester away on Tuesday. Is it sort of we go again and straight in with the squad, or you know, have you got some decisions to make? Yeah, no, we'll have a look and we'll have a look what's needed for Tuesday night. It's a long journey, you know, um, so we'll, we'll sort of prepare properly. Um, it'll be a different challenge to today, um, but we're looking forward to it. Like I said, we're in good form, and uh, this league's about that. You have to sort of enjoy the wins, enjoy your Saturday night, but then tomorrow we'll wake up and start preparing for what will be a difficult game on Tuesday. Brilliant. Well, uh, well done today. Good luck next week and um, hopefully we'll keep scoring goals. Cheers.